Hi, it's my favorite time of day, the time of day when I get to read a good book to you. Today we're going to read Full House, An Invitation to Fractions by Dale Ann Dodds and Abby Carter. Uh, at my school we're studying fractions right now. Maybe you know something about fractions. This is a good book to introduce you to fractions if you haven't started studying them yet. And it's a rhyming book. The Strawberry Inn was run by Miss Bloom. Happy was she to fill every room. With one for herself and five for the guests, there were six rooms in all for a cozy night's rest. Can you see one, two, three, four, five, six rooms? So we have six rooms total. Six rooms in one whole house. Knock, knock, went the door, ding dong, the bell rang. Welcome, welcome, Miss Bloom sang. I arrest that be my wish, said Sea Captain Duffy, who smelled just like fish. So Sea Captain Duffy, all tired and done, followed Miss Bloom to room number one. Now one room of six had a guest for the night. To fill up the inn would be pure delight. Do you see one out of six? Whenever you see a fraction, the line means out of. So one room out of six were full. See the light on in that one room? Knock, knock, went the door, ding dong, the bell rang. Welcome, welcome, Miss Bloom sang. Charmed, I'm sure, said the Duchess Buffet. Smoochie and I are on holiday. So the Duchess Buffet and Sapphires of Blue followed Miss Bloom to room number two. Now two rooms of six had guests for the night. To fill up the inn would be pure delight. So we have two out of six full. Do you see the two lights? Out of one, two, three, four, five, six. Two out of six, two sixths is how we say that. Knock, knock, went the door, ding dong, the bell rang. Welcome, welcome, Miss Bloom sang. Care for a hairbrush, a toothbrush, a comb, or maybe a vacuum, said salesman Jerome. Arms full of shoe polish, pots, pans, and tea. He followed Miss Bloom to room number three. Now three rooms of six had guests for the night. To fill up the inn would be pure delight. We have three out of six. Do you see one, two, three lights up? Out of six whole rooms. Knock, knock, went the door. Ding dong, the bell rang. Welcome, welcome, Miss Bloom sang. In town for my show, said Trainer P. Klein. From smallest to largest, his dog stood in line. Then Trainer P. Klein and Doggies Galore danced down the hall to room number four. Now four rooms of six had guests for the night. To fill up the inn would be pure delight. Four out of six total. Look at all those dogs going in the room. They're going to be pretty full in there. Knock, knock, went the door, ding dong, the bell rang. Welcome, welcome, Miss Bloom sang. My biggest race ever, said Johnny Z Power. I hit 210 miles per hour. Carrying his trophy and pleased to arrive, he followed Miss Bloom to room number five. Five rooms of six had guests for the night, filling Miss Bloom with pure delight. So we have five out of six. Do you see that almost all the lights are on now, right? because we have almost the whole house filled up because five is pretty close to six. What do you think is gonna to happen to our fraction when the whole house is filled up when Miss Bloom goes to her room for the night? Let's see. <clears throat> then into the kitchen, Miss Bloom went to make a scrumptious dinner for all to partake. There were chicken and peas, potatoes au gratin, but the very best part, Miss Bloom had forgotten. What do you think she forgot? A strawberry cake with whipped cream piled high still sat on the counter when the dish, last dish was dry. Tired and happy, they all went to bed. Miss Bloom in room six. It's a full house, she said. So do you see our fraction now? Because we have all six rooms lit up Six out of six rooms are full. That means one whole house is full. The guests and Miss Bloom all called out good night, plumped up each pillow and turned off each light. 
But then in the dark came shuffles and wiggles, whispers and mumbles, scuffles and giggles. Shadows were tiptoeing down the long hall, but where were they going, bathrobes and all? Erp, slurp, yummy, yum. Suddenly, Miss Bloom sat up in bed. Something's not right at my inn, she said. She rushed to the kitchen and turned on the light. There she saw an astonishing sight. Five out of six, and the dogs and the cat stood covered in cake from toe to top hat. Well, said Miss Bloom, and tiddledee dee, thank you for saving the last piece for me. Do you see there's one, two, three, four, five, plus Miss Bloom is six, and they had cut the cake into one, two, three, four, five, six pieces. Luckily, they saved one for her. Six out of six pieces gone now means the whole cake is gone. And that's the end. All right, I hope you were able to learn something about fractions from that book. And I will see you next time. Bye, Reese.